we've got a lot happening in Tulsa this week, starting with the Senior PGA Championship opening today at Southern Hills. And our very own Mike Brooks is anchoring the show live from the course this morning. We'll go to him very soon. But first, as the restaurant and hospitality industry gears up, Tulsa's Southern Hills Country Club is rearing to go as part of our team coverage this morning. Brady Havlib joins us from outside of the club there. And Brady, how are staff and groundskeepers getting that course show ready? Because everyone's going to be watching. Yeah, well, when you look, take a look at a golf course, you never really think about all of the work that goes into making each blade of grass in the perfect spot. And crews here have been working for months to make it absolutely perfect for when. So when fans show up here, it is uh, spectacular. And that's exactly what they were able to do. There are just over 250 acres of land here to cover with only a 35 man crew to care for all of it. That includes ground staff and course mechanics. Many of them have sacrificed long, long hours and getting ready for this big event and to help with their efforts. Dozens of volunteers from the PGA have actually come to Tulsa to help join their ranks for their last week of preparations. It's been a almost a Herculean effort by not just our crew but their families to accept them not being there from dawn till dark for a long period of time. It's now being supported by about 45 volunteers from all over the country that have come in to help us get through this week. Toss the mic. And getting the course ready for spring golfers is an annual event for crews here, and it often entails restoring the fairways and closely monitoring the growth of grass. Um, and coming up in our next half hour, we explore why this year was particularly challenging and how it has impacted their efforts to get everything ready for the PGA. And uh, of course, they are expecting a lot of people here each day of the event. They're expecting 8,000 fans. Tickets are still on sale. So if you haven't gotten your ticket, you're still able to do that. You just go online and uh, check for available tickets there. Now today it kicks off the Pro-Am practice, but the actual tee off won't begin again until Thursday morning. Everything starts up around 9 a.m. this morning, so we're hoping for good weather actually because it's a little cloudy out here right now, but it um, we're, we're just hoping and praying that no water will come down and ruin the grass. So uh, we're we're hoping for that right now. For now we'll send it on uh, to Mike Brooks.